so, um, I didn't really have a lot to talk about, but I thought I'd get on here anyways and just say a few things. Um, and Justin's on 1 to 10 this week, and he's been on this schedule since Monday, and I really hate 1 to 10. I hate it. He goes in at 1 in the afternoon, and he gets off at 10 at night. And I don't like it because it makes my day seem so much longer. And, um, I just don't like it. But he doesn't like it either, so. It's gotta work. But, um, I hope you can hear me. My mic's way over here. But anyway, so, I think he's off tomorrow, but I'm not sure. See, he was supposed to work Sunday, and he didn't know it. Because he looked at the wrong schedule. Because they have like their schedules online on their website or whatever. And whenever he checked it, he looked. It's in six week incre increments. So whenever he checked it, he looked at the wrong week. And so he was supposed to work Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday, and Thursday. And then he was supposed to be off Friday and Saturday. And I've got something in my eye. And um, he looked at the wrong schedule, and the schedule he looked at, he didn't have to work until Monday. And so he didn't go to work. And then Sunday night at like 11 o'clock, he decided that he was going to check the schedule to make sure what time he had to be at work the next day. And then he realized that he had looked at the wrong one, and he was supposed to have worked Sunday. So he was supposed to work, so he said that he would just work Friday um, to make up for not working Sunday. But, um, he didn't realize that Friday was Halloween when he said that, so he told his boss that he'd work Friday. And then, when he came home, I was like, you know Friday's Halloween, right? And he was like, crap, I forgot about it. Well, in the meantime, he got sent to Dallas at 7 o'clock Tuesday. And he got home at about 9 o'clock last night. 7 o'clock. P.M. Tuesday. He worked till 7 o'clock and then at 7 they told him to go to Dallas. So he went to Dallas, went to a store, was there until like 8 in the morning on um, Wednesday morning. Then he got a hotel and crashed and slept until like 3 and then he came home. He got home at like 9. So he worked like 20 something hours. He ended up putting like 20 something hours in from the time he went to work. Tuesday until the time he got home from his trip Wednesday. So he, um, so he's thinking that he probably won't have to work tomorrow to make up for it. But, um, because he really wants to be off to see the kids and go trick or treating. But, um, my mom's going to come over and go trick or treating with us. So if he has to go to work, she'll be here and I won't have to do it by myself. I don't like being out in public alone. Um, I have a lot of anxiety about it. I don't like going anywhere by myself, and especially not just with me, with my kids. Um, especially not in, at night time. And um, so my mom's gonna come over, and she's gonna go trick or treating with us. Which she wanted to see the kids in their Halloween anyway, in their Halloween costumes anyways. So we just decided that she could come over, and we could do the trick or treat thing, and then we could get some pizza for dinner or something and have him deliver it and then, you know, she could stay the night and make a little day of it, so. No, it's no, 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 hush. It's Noah's. Well, it's Noah's, but you don't have to holler. No. So, that's it's Halloween Noah. for us. And, and we did carve a pumpkin and it's got two faces. One side is a face and the other side is a spider wheel with a spider. No, I wanted to do the cat, but the cat was really hard, and I'm not that, um, um, not that good at carving pumpkins. So, so, um, we did the spider web with the spider because it was easier, and then no one wanted a face, so I only got, well, we only got one pumpkin, but it's, like, huge. Justin got, like, the biggest one they had, I think. So, we did the other side, we did a face, and... We didn't buy any, any lights to put in it because we completely forgot about it in Mars Halloween, so I'm not really that worried about it. But we put it out on the porch, and no likes it, so that's all that really matters. I gutted it thinking that I would make a pumpkin pie out of it, 
but I forgot to get um, a pie crust, and I didn't have the thing, the, any other ingredients here to make one, so I just chunked it. I looked online trying to find something I could do with it, um, but all the recipes that it, you know I could find had ingredients that I didn't have. So, um, you know, like flour. I don't have any flour. Justin got sugar today. Um, I have eggs, but I mean, I have. We gotta get some grocery store bag. We usually go shopping every two weeks and get tons of crap, but I mean, we have food, but we don't have like baking crap because I haven't bought it in a long time. I don't usually bake until like this time of the year because in the summertime it's just too hot to bake. And I don't hardly ever use flour for anything other than baking, so I don't need it. And um, so I'm going to have to go to the store and get the stuff to um, bake because I'm in the baking mode, you know. I want to make cookies and cakes and crap like that. And I'm going to make that cracker barrel poke cake or whatever it is that silver screen girl made. I'm going to make that for Thanksgiving. I already told Justin, but I might make one before Thanksgiving to you know, like try it out. So that's what I plan on making. So, um, for not having a whole lot to say, I sure did ramble. I wish that my camera had a timer on it that could tell me how long I've been talking because I completely don't even pay attention to the clock. I think I've been talking for six minutes, but I could be wrong. What else do I want to say? Um, I want to say congratulations to um, Tushy and Falcon, Tushy Galore and Falcon, for finally getting his hind end down here to Arkansas so they could be together. And um, they seem like they're happy about it, you know, so happy. They're probably holed up in their house, not going to leave for wanting to see each other, but. That's fine, too. Um, so I'm going to congratulate him and say that I'm happy for him. And I wish him the best. And I want to say... Um, I want to say hi to Peaches927, which is Pam. Hi, Pam. Mainly just want to say hi to Pam because I haven't really seen her. I, mean, I haven't really uh, talked to her a whole lot lately. I've been... Uh, withdrawn from YouTube a bit if you haven't noticed. I haven't been commenting that much on videos and I really haven't been watching a lot of videos to be honest with you because I just don't feel like it. I kind of got a little burnout and I don't know why because I really haven't done that much on here but whatever. Well, I'm going to get off here now and throw my kids in a bathtub and put them in a bed. Justin will be home soon and I hope he doesn't have to work tomorrow. I'm sleeping in in the morning. I'm so sleeping in in the morning. I'm so tired, y'all. Okay, I love you. And I hope everybody has a good day. Bye.